If you're looking to generate AI art for free, then you're going to want to check out these platforms. Now, I'm not talking about free trials like with Midjourney and Dali, which are some of the best ones, and you do get access for free and have to pay later. I'm talking about some platforms you can use 100% for free online, and we're going to get into some of those right now. The first one is Stable Diffusion, a little bit more of a technical sort of AI art platform, so I thought I'd start with it. Also, one of the big three that people know about, it is one of those platforms you can actually sort of download and install on your computer and it's a little bit more technical to use and requires a little bit more sort of technical expertise but it is free it's open source and you can download and use it to generate some pretty cool results especially once you learn your way around uh, using the platform while on the topic of stable diffusion there's also hugging face which has a lot of stable diffusion interfaces set up so you actually don't have to install it you can just head on there and actually start generating images straight on the hugging face space as well so that's another place where you can get access to Stable Diffusion for free. The next is Blue Willow AI, which you also access in Discord, similar to Mid Journey. However, it does seem to produce much higher resolution images that are typically about 2000 pixels by 2000 pixels as opposed to 1024 by 1024, uh, which Mid Journey and a lot of other platforms produce. Uh, it's actually a pretty cool platform and easy to use. And if you've used Mid Journey, it's easy to make the transition because a lot of the setup is the same. It is 100% free, so head to bluewillow.ai to check that out. The next is Crayon, that's C-R-A-I-Y-O-N, produces some pretty basic imagery. And uh, although you see a lot of ads on this platform, that is essentially how you're paying for it. The ads are what are supporting the platform and keeping it free. It produces some pretty basic images, but can be a lot of fun to play with also. The Playground AI is a little more advanced and has a really cool user interface and that enables you to switch between certain platforms and although you have to pay for some platforms, you don't have to pay for the Stable Diffusion models, but uh, you have things like your prompts, you can also do things such as image to image and have a whole bunch of settings that you can explore along with styles. So it's a little bit more advanced and also is able to produce some very high resolution, also high quality artwork. Um, it's a sort of a great platform that amalgamates a bunch of different AI art and uh, makes it a bit more accessible to people and easier to use. Check out Playground AI as that's one definitely to watch out for. Another free and fairly simple uh, platform is Pixray. Not quite as advanced as some of the other ones on this list, but it does produce some nice sort of abstract looking imagery. Another one that could be fun to play with if you wanted to check out something just a bit different. Finally, we have Leonardo.ai, which is making a lot of noise at the moment uh, because it has so many features and a very easy to use interface. It uses uh, Stable Diffusion and a bunch of other models. It also has its own model uh, attached to it and a bunch of community models that people have come up with as well, where you get to choose various styles to apply to your prompt from there. And there's also some other things such as a canvas editor and just a whole bunch of different uh, features you can use to produce better AI art and images with. However, it is actually not 100% free and I try to stay away from these point-based uh, platforms today. However, this one has a large number of points that you get every day and you actually play with it for a good serious amount of time every day before you even run out of points. So it's, it's basically free and produces some wonderful looking artwork and one worth checking out. So links to all of those will be in the description below, but uh, otherwise that's the video for today. I'd like to thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please consider giving it a like or check out my channel for more AI art uh, information. Otherwise have a great day and I hope to see you again soon.